that's going to be a bit weird. I mean, look at this. She has the birth date, 28th uh, of July, 1976, while uh, his dad is born in 1945. So that, that's kind of the hilarious part of this story. She's calling him her son. Hey, welcome to another Bumpai video and my name is Art and today we have another manga reading and manga reading for those who are unaware is basically me reading a couple of manga that I either own for various years like these or pretty new ones that I bought recently and what I'll do I'll just flip through them look for cars, motorcycles, any other vehicles that I can identify and give you some information about those. So that's basically it. Um, this is like the second to last episode for You're Under Arrest. You're Under Arrest is a series uh, I've explained extensively and you can click here for a video that will explain you what it is about and who created it. I'm not going to repeat myself over and over again. And this is the seventh episode of this series. Um, yeah, so we'll simply discard this manga for now and just continue reading this one and it's going to be a short one today so on the cover itself we already can identify a small mini bike and this is a yamaha mini bike um, a yamaha poke or pocky pokemon uh, i don't know what, what what it's called but um it's a very small bike and those were fashionable in the 70s and 80s and I think the Honda Monkey is one of those that made it overseas, but this Yamaha Pocket never made it outside Japan, I guess. So that one is on the cover. Um, about the manga itself. It, so this time it's uh, revolving about uh, Nakajima. Nakajima, previous episode, we had something about his father, um, or including his father. And this episode, it continues basically with his father. So he's trying to visit his father and then there is this Caterham Super 7 parked in front of it. So he's a bit um, bit intrigued what it is. So when he goes in there's this young girl and he's really surprised like what the heck is she doing there. Um, and then it turns out that he just met his new stepmom. So she calls him her son. So she's younger than he is, and of course, that's going to be a bit weird. I mean, look at this. She has the birth date, 28th uh, of July, 1976, while uh, his dad is born in 1945. So that's a big age uh, difference. So that, that's kind of the hilarious part of this story. She's calling him uh, his, her son. So yeah, basically uh, the story continues. She drives off in her uh, Caterham 7 or Super 7. The Caterham bought the rights for the Lotus 7. So they continued building the Lotus 7 and improve it. That, that's why it's called the Super 7. Anyway, uh, uh, next day she wakes up her stepson and asks him to join her in her Caterham, she drives him around and then you can see here that there's someone saying something about our subject have gone off to a good start. So there is something going on. Uh, they continue visiting a store. She calls her him his son. Uh, she calls him her son. So that's kind of hilarious. <laughs> Uh, she tells him how she met his father and how she came to be his stepmom. And in the meanwhile, a couple of thugs are stealing her Caterham Super 7. So they drive off with a Caterham and of course, everyone was already aware that those guys were basically uh, trying to steal the car and they were using her as bait. So the police surrounds the two thugs uh, with a bunch of uh, crowns and other police vehicles. And you know, there's a little bit more information here about one of those crowns, this one, because it's a special one. And that's why I highlighted that one. And not, I'm not going into detail which one is which, because that's very difficult to see at this moment.
Um, continuing on to the next story, um, the cover is basically uh, one of the mystery cars that I featured in the previous episode and this mystery car is a BMW Isetta and that's what Red CZ guessed. So he guessed it correctly, this is a, a BMW Isetta. Uh, it's an Isetta 300, I think this is the first facelifted version, not the second one, so it's pretty original. These are a three-wheeled um, or a tricycle basically. Um, they're basically a motorbike so it has the engine in the back driving the rear wheel and then the two front wheels are the ones that are steering and the steering wheel is inside this door which is pretty special. I mean there are hardly any cars that have this configuration where the door actually uh, is where you're steering. So BMW was in uh, a difficult, con uh, difficult waters uh, when they were trying to recover from the Second World War. And of course they uh, tried everything to stay afloat. And this is one of the attempts and it was quite successful. They made a whole bunch of these small Isettas. Um, continuing we see some Harley Davidson motorcycle i think i'm not a motorcycle genius so if you have any other thoughts about that please tell me his story revolves around santa claus or uh, around christmas so we have santa claus here the police agents are, are of course they're they're guarding uh, shopping centers and they're using their honda today which is a police special and I covered this car and the special rims extensively in the previous episode. You can find it here if you haven't seen it already. Um, then we continue. Uh, there's something to do with Santa calling people. Uh, yeah, you know, um, he, he, he threw out the garbage, so he's a bad guy. So he gets scolded by Santa Claus. And this Santa Claus is riding a very modern sleigh. A motorcycle and they recognize him as strike man no he's not strike man he is santa claus man of course and of course we all know that it's uh, strike man from the previous episode uh, the story continues where they are chasing him down using the honda today and this moto compo bike i've covered the moto compo bike in a previous episode as well you can find it here and they stop the second mystery car and it's actually not a car, it's a motorbike. So this motorbike is called a Honda Gyro. Nobody guessed that one, uh, because I think it's an oddball. I think this is only available in uh, Japan and maybe it got sold overseas in, uh, in Asia, but nowhere else as far as I know. So this is basically a motorbike that's, uh, that has like, a, it's a tricycle as well but the two rear wheels are stationary and then the midsection is basically able to, um, to tilt. So it's a tilting mechanism. And Honda made a patent on that so nobody else is able to buy it or build it. And this is extremely good for deliveries because your deliveries will be kept horizontally while with a delivery bike it would tilt as well. Um, continuing onwards, we can see here a second generation Honda High Ace uh, ambulance, I think. Um, <laughs> and I say I think because you know, it, it could as well be uh, a Nissan, but I think it's actually a High Ace because the High Aces were uh, in larger quantities than the Nissan. Uh, continuing, they're chasing down uh, our big Santa Claus man on his motorcycle. They finally are able to stop him. They rip off his mask and find, surprise, surprise, Strike Man. So that's hardly any surprise to be honest. And that's it for this episode. So for number seven we're done. So the only thing remaining is number eight. So the preview for number eight are two mystery cars. So this is mystery car number one and this is mystery car number two. So if you have any clue what these two mystery cars are please let me know in the comments below 
And that's it for today for this short episode on manga reading. And I hope to see you soon in the last and final episode of Manga Reading of Your Under Arrest. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time. Ba 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 bam 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 b